Yo, what is poppin' my beautiful people? It's your boy Lexi back with another video, and uh, it's a special one. I hope uh, it's actually uh, New Year's today. Um, I'm actually recording this like at 1 or 2 a.m. I just got done celebrating uh, the New Year's celebration, so I hope everyone had a safe and fun holiday with their family and friends, and I hope you guys can enjoy this game plan I'm about to display for you. Uh, as you can tell by the title, this is um, going to be the uh, third mark game for my T95 E6. But uh, look with a twist, and we'll see what happens whenever we get when we get to that. Um, but anyway, here we are. We're playing on uh, Westfield, and I'm telling them to cover me for uh, which position I'm going to go to here. Uh, I got two platoon mates here, uh, coordinating with them. I'm going to tell them where I'm going to be going and all that. So let's see. Let's see what we can do here. I think uh, I do believe I was at like uh, 90, 94 point. Point two something, I believe, at the beginning of this game. 94.2, 94.3 something. So let's see what we can do in this battle. See, I was worried about a light tank going to the uh, G6, G7 area, but it turns out he actually went north, so we got lucky there. We're going to get some spotting on the bat chat. Uh, about 750. We're going to get a shot on the move there. We're up to 1100 spotting already. We're going to get a bounce off the 257. Going nuts, going nuts. 1500 spotting now which is 400 2000 spotting just on our way over here make that 2600 and it's just going up at this point we only have 407 damage at 2600 uh, spotting absolutely nuts this guy is kind of he's, he's going wild that was a bad shot by me i thought i could get my gun down i'm just going to be cheeky here i'm just going to go ahead and go for this i, I kind of felt bad about bouncing that shot and i was like i'm gonna i'm gonna pin you and this guy comes around and uh, I didn't realize this until I was watching the replay, but he was a, he actually wasn't fully upgraded. I didn't see that in the game. That was really bad of me. Uh, sadly, my platoon mate's going to drop there. We're already up to 3,000 spotting and 1,200 damage. Going nuts, guys. Going nuts. Uh, I'm going to put a shot right into the dirt there. Uh, hit the dirt for about zero damage. Hit its tracks, you know. We're going to come around. We're going to actually put it into his tracks because we suck at this game. And we're going to make sure we aim our shots because we can't be missing. Uh, we we got to take this guy out. And uh, missing those shots is not helping. He's going to put one into us. And this is where... Uh, so I will. my next video is actually going to be on this tank. It's going to be a how to play on this tank. Um, but it, you just have to keep the gun firing in these types of positions. You have to keep the gun firing if you want to make this tank effective. you got to keep the gun working. That's what I'm trying to do here. And we actually low roll there. Not able to take out the 257. So he's going to be able to come around and he's going to get cheeky. I kind of panicked there a little bit, put one into the ground, but luckily he bounces, so we're going to be able to, to take him out there. We were loading up heat there. I didn't want to take any chances. We're going to wait to get unspotted, and we're already up to about 6,000 combined. Going nuts, guys. Now I realize we're in a bit of a situation. I'm being rushed by two heavy tanks. We're going to try to get a cheeky shot into the Iron Army there. We put one into his tracks. And now we're in a bit of a situation. We got a 780 on our right. I can't remember the tank on the left, but there's a heavy tank to our left. I think it was another 257. Um, but uh, I, 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 I'm asking my platoon mate to help, but there's really not much he can do. So I'm trying to uh, figure out, because I can't back up because I'll get shot in my butt. So I'm trying to figure out how I can take on this, uh, this brand new tier 10 premium heavy. So let's see what we do here. So he's gonna come around. I believe he's actually gonna shoot. If he shoots, I see that, and I'm just, I'm just at this point. I'm just like, all right, fuck it, we ball. So I'm gonna put one into his lower plate. We're gonna back up, and I see the Progetto. So I'm gonna try to get behind the Progetto, and nope, he's actually gonna get another shot. So I'm just gonna play it. I'm just gonna say, go, we're going, we're going. Put one, damages ammo rack. We're gonna just keep our gun working. We're gonna reload again go up the hill we're gonna put one in we're gonna use this guy's cover back 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 we're gonna reload 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 are we gonna get it and no we are not we are not able to uh to finish off that 780 almost pulled off a crazy play there um uh anyway we we uh, i can't remember how much damage we had off the top of my head but let's get to those post game stats and see if uh let's see if uh we made it there let's see let's see let's see all right, 4,000 damage, 4,400 assisted, and are you kidding me? 94.99%. It left me at 94.99%. So I ended up playing, I think, two or three more games, and uh, 
they were really just average. I think I ended up dropping down to 94.82. And then I got to this game right here, guys. And this is uh, the actual three mark game on Pearl River. And uh, it's kind of crazy. Uh, kind of crazy. Let's get to the end. Let's get to the end. So uh, here we are on Pearl River. Uh, I like to play most of my spots pretty, pretty much the same. Um, no matter what tank I'm in, I'm telling everyone where I'm going. I like to communicate with my team. I feel like it gives us a better chance to win. All right, let's see. So I found the only counter is uh, like the F, uh, F4, F5 area, which we're actually gonna see right about, it's gonna be coming up. I think there's an E75 that ends up going there and messing everything up. Yep, yep, there's an E75. Where that E75 is, the perfect counter to what I try to do on this flank. And I'm actually really irritated that he goes there because it ruins my whole plan. So I actually decided to push up here because uh, aggression, I, I, I like to be very aggressive when going for these marks. So I'm trying to just spot for my team. Uh, that's what I usually try to do when I try to go for these marks of excellence, uh, which is another video idea I want to do. I want to go over how to and really how they work. Uh, there's our first spot. We spot the STRV-103B, and we're going to pass. Never been great at pinning those tanks. Still haven't figured it out, but we're going to get an easy 1,200 spotting damage there. Easy money, guys. But uh, really, it's just about playing the whole peekaboo game here, and uh, you can see the clear detected symbol there. And I'm, I'm kinda, I was kind of freaking out. I didn't know what was looking at me. So now we're going to poke, and that's what it was. Very scary. We're going to put a shot in the back shit bar in there. And really, it's just, uh, I see artillery looking at me, so now I'm going to try to back up behind this rock here. We hit it. I'm worried an artillery round's coming in, and it never comes. But this, he's still looking at me. And then I realize there's a 5120 behind me. Now I'm kind of wor worrying, but I got, don't worry, I got teammates. Put one into the 5120. Looks like my team's going to take him out. We're going to go forward. Right about now, and already missed. Dodge that already round. Let's go. We're up to 2,000 spawning, 1,100 damage. We're going to bounce around off the 4,005. Very lucky there. We're going to RBRT around into him. Kind of freaked me out. Got very, very lucky. Could have easily uh, swayed the game there. That that was that was nuts. Uh, now I'm, I'm, I'm a little jittery because uh, bouncing a 4,005 shell. And then I hear my teammates. They're actually telling me that we're losing the base, but I didn't really look at the map. I was just listening to them. So I'm going to go ahead and travel back to the base, but there's not really any point to it. We're already up 15 to 8. I don't know what I was thinking here. Um, it wasn't a very smart play by me. I should not have come back. I was actually talking to myself about this. I was like, I should not have come back here. I should not have come back here. I'm trying to find whatever damage I can. So I decided to just go ahead and go back to what I was doing and pushing up the southern flank there. Because there's only one tank there. I'm not going to be able to make it to the north to get any of that damage. So let's go see what we can do here. I'm going to go ahead and go to the south. We're going to go help this T-95. That's just steamrolling through the south. There's not a care in the world. But yeah, at this point, I was actually really nervous because there was only five tanks left. And I was like, I need some damage. I need some damage. So I know that there's a 4,005 back here, so I'm actually going to load up an HE round because I need to get, I need to maximize my damage capabilities. And he spotted the T95 actually puts 750 into him, so it allows us to, to shut him down in one. And now I'm worried. I'm like, okay, I don't, I don't have enough to uh, to get that third mark, but let's see what we can do. And <gasps> glorious, a full health Yag Tiger at the end of the match, all alone, just with me. And uh, he's actually going to make a play that's really going to help me here he's just going to completely ignore me and we're just going to use our dpm and windle him down and uh, at this point i was pretty pretty confident that i was going to be able to get my third mark but it's kind of crazy it's kind of crazy let's let's see let's see these post game stats so uh we actually didn't even finish top three which is nuts but i was just rushing to see rushing to see and i'm at 95 percent. it almost hit me with a 94.99 again guys that is absolutely insane. Um, anyway, that's my first video of 2023. Uh, I have so many more videos planned for you guys. Uh, please subscribe if you uh, want to catch any of those videos and don't want to miss any of them. Please leave a like down below. Uh, comment any anything you guys want to. Have some discussions down there. And I'll catch you all next time. I'm running out of time. Every day goes by so fast. 
and every